And look at that. You're going to win a World Series trip with ColecoVision. Interesting. Wow. Welcome in, everyone. Welcome to Jailbreak Pack Rip Battle. I am Keith, Vintage Sport Flips. And I'm Andy, King of Penance. Damn it. I always yeah. do the wrong one. Yeah, I never, thought it was going to look so smooth. It's going to look so smooth, and then I totally mess no. it up. Get, you're never going to be smooth. <laughs> never going to be smooth. Yeah. Uh, so, guys, on this in these video segments, we open up either vintage, mostly vintage, some modern packs, boxes. And in this episode, we're going to open up a pack of 1983 Topps Baseball. We actually opened up a pair of these previously in a video, or sort of in a video. We opened up a pair. We went through it. Didn't hit anything great, but we're about to sign off. We realized we never hit record. Yep. So that's a mistake. Yeah, that's <laughs> lost forever. Uh, okay. But this one, we're already recording. Double check that. Yeah. We only have one this time. So uh, usually we open up a, one each as a competition, but uh, not the case uh, today. But so yeah, cool. we're we're teaming this time, so yeah, yeah. So Annie, do you know the the big rookies? I mean, big in quotation marks. Yeah. The big rookies you're aiming for in this spot in this pack. Can't remember exactly. Was it is this the Sandberg or uh, Gwyn, or is this? Yeah, you got two out of three. Yeah, the Sandberg uh, Gwyn. Uh, is that Cal Ripken too? Right? Isn't he eighty three or is 82. he eighty two? Eighty two for Ripken. Yeah, so you can get a second year Ripken, but the the other one is Wade Boggs. Right, right, right. Boggs Gwyn. Boggs, Gwyn, and Sandberg. So, uh, all right. Without further ado, let's uh, open up the rip cam here. All right. So here we go. So tops 83, the real one. I think they were using that because they were in competition at this point with Fleer and Don Russ. And look at that. You're going to win a World Series trip with ColecoVision. Interesting. Wow. Throwback video game console there. Maybe right. we should make a wager on who's going to win the Super Bowl. Or the Super Bowl, the World Series. 80, so let's see what 80, 83 or 84. Let's see. 83, 84, was, 84 was the Tigers. I know actually. 83, I think, was well, it's Phillies and Baltimore. I think it was okay. Baltimore. These all right, we're starting strong. <laughs> strong with Clyde. <laughs> yeah, Clyde King. And I don't remember Clyde, him being like a Yankee. I mean, he looks like Martin Scorsese. <laughs> Is that Martin Scorsese? <laughs> Oh, that's not uh, Martin Scorsese. Does, De Niro has like that uh, sort of, if they did like a modern gangster movie where they're like close to retirement. Yeah. Well, uh, no, 100%. But, but not only has he got a Clyde King manager car, but he also has a wax stain. Really yeah. ruining no, the value of that high honestly, grade Clyde honestly, King. Yeah, better him than somebody else. Yeah. Nope. Jerry Uger. Wow. Don't know that. That's, that's a unique right. name. I've never heard of him. And, and you're a Tigers guy. I know. 84. I mean, this year they had a good, they must have had a good team because they won it the next year. So, yeah. Um, I'm sure they're really like Lance Parrish and Jack Morris, I think. And I do Let's not see. remember that guy. <laughs> uh, complete games. Must have been a, star yeah, a starter. All right. Gene Tanat Tennis Tenace. I, I, we've compiled his card before, but I never know how to pronounce his name. Yeah. I assume it's not Tanachi. <laughs> There we go. Got some uh, Carlton strikeout leader, Steve Carlton, Floyd Bannister. I don't recall. I don't remember Floyd Bannister being good. Man, you know it's a good pack. It's a double manager pack. Double manager. Renee Lockerman. Whew. Does he have a cigar in his hand? <laughs> he might. He maybe he just like have his thumb tucked in there. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, might be. Joe so, Rudy, mm -hmm. second catcher slash first baseman as well. Yeah. Got a very versatile team going on right here. Ned Yost. Ned I do remember him, right? Yeah, he was a good catcher. Here's the uh, Tops trivia card. Let me spin it around because we're facing the other direction now. Bob, Bob. Welsh. Chris Welsh. Double back to back Welshes, even though different spellings. Yeah, they're just spelled, spelled slightly differently, I think. Yeah. Mickey Hatcher. That's a, he's got just a goofy face there. What if we can get a player who starts? Yeah, I want to start. <laughs> Rudy. Nope. Actually, Ned Yo's probably started. There we go. Morgan, there Hall of go. Famer, Joe Morgan. Obviously, late in his career. 
Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, right. Right. here we go. Very cool. Yeah. It like, looks, like, looks like it's pretty, uh, well, centering's a little bit off, but the, yeah. the uh, corners are, well, that bottom right corner is not perfect. It's well, a pretty nice condition. I don't know. This could be a Padre behind it, too. This is not, you, oh, oh, Rich no. Dower. <laughs> George, George Fraser. All right. Well, that's that's better than to be expected. We at least yeah. we hit one of the three top rookie cards. That's right. I, yeah, probably the third best. Right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Terrible Phillies manager. They like the worst manager in Phillies history. Ryan Sandberg. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, he managed the Phillies, I think, for like part of a season. He was a minor league manager. He came up and then he basically left the team midseason, just uh didn't wasn't fired. Uh, they just left on his own accord. So huh. ter terrible season for him. Uh, but yeah, so at least I'm still happy to hit that card. Pretty cool card for yeah. uh, when you're opening I up. I do remember kind of like wanting going for that card back in the day or something or trying to trade for it, I feel like. Yeah. Uh, and and when you're opening those kind of vintage tops wax packs, you know, they, they're such a massive checklist, like in the 700s. Yeah. The percentages aren't great to hit stuff. So that was. <laughs> Not at yeah. all. <laughs> yeah. No. Your your percentages shouldn't have been great to hit two managers too, but we managed to do that. So <laughs> yeah, yeah. So the odds were in our favor today. Yeah. So yeah. So that wraps it up. Thanks everyone for watching. If you're into cards, into memorabilia, watch our podcast Wednesday night, 8 p.m. Eastern time. We delve into reselling. We draft a sports or non-sports topic, show values of things, discuss cards, fun time, engage the chat. It's a live podcast. Eight o'clock on on this channel. Yeah, always a good time. We have a good group of people love to chat and uh, oh yeah, mess yeah, around fun, fun and, chat. and some actually some pretty good uh, knowledge going on there. These uh, some of these guys that when watching this now, I feel like are uh, practically better at pricing than than you and I are. At least you. Well, well at least you. Oh come on now, <laughs> no, nailed on. it. Got you before no. you could get me. But yeah, so check us out over there. And otherwise, check us out every Thursday night, 6 p.m. We put out one of these pack opening videos. So check us out weekly. All right, so that wraps it up. Thanks for watching. Peace. Out.